been filming all day because I kind of have been. So, I just went out to the mailbox and my lovely Sephora box came. And I also have something from Old Navy. And I just went and got some jewelry yesterday. And I'm wearing some of it. And I've been buying a bunch of stuff for spring. And I wanted to show you guys what it is. So first we're going to do our Sephora box. Really fast. I know I'm like a knife girl. Sorry if this offends anyone. You can deal with that. I'm sorry. Okay. Ah! The box is ruined. It's going to be ruined. Okay. Oh. Ha. Huh. Okay. This is my Sephora play box. Looks like. So cute. Oh my goodness. Look how cute that is, guys. Oh, and the stuff's coming out. Okay. So it looks like number six. So this is only box number six, like ever. Okay. So February 2016, now and later. This month, lip tips, hairstyle savers, purse essentials, and more how to's for looking your best all day and all night. Okay. So we have that. And our little book has all the different products. I don't want to look at it too much because I don't want to know what it is yet. Ta da! And then this little play pass, I can take this into Sephora. And they can show me how to use everything and I don't have to like pay or whatever. Okay. Ta da! Oh. Okay, number one Tom Ford Black Orchid perfume. I bet this is going to be good. Sorry, my garage sale stuff is behind me. And it's getting dark, so I'm trying to go fast. I think I'm. Is that for men? It might be for guys. I don't love it. It kind of smells weird. Okay. Then we got Lancome Drama Liquid Pencil. Okay. Just one. Okay. Extreme Longwear Eyeliner. I'm assuming it's just black. Ooh, that's cute. I'm excited for that. Let's see what it looks like. Ooh, it goes on pretty nice. Nice and slick. This was the Tom Ford Black Orchid, by the way. I'm, I don't know if it's men's or not, but it smells weird. I don't like it. <laughs> okay. And then this BB, let's see. If I bumble and bumble, it's pret a powder pret -a powder It's equal parts dry shampoo and style extender and volume in a pinch. Apply to dry hair starting at the roots and style. Wow, this is going to be interesting. It's a cute little bottle. Okay. And then we got... Pop of Passion by Bare Minerals Lip Oil Balm. Cute little box. They're a little smaller than I anticipated, which is totally fine. Look how cute that is. There's bare minerals on it. Okay, let's open it before I hurt it. Ooh. Let's see. Ooh, that's cute. I like that color. It's like perfect for spring. Now if I can not hurt it. My lipsticks tend to get ruined. I don't know what the heck happens. Oh, I've had this before. Okay, I got this in Ipsy or Birchbox or something. Probably Ipsy. I don't know. It's Lights, Camera, Lashes. It's by Tarte. It is a... Oh, sorry. It's a um, mascara. And I actually really liked it a lot. I didn't buy the full size only because I kept getting more and more mascara. I think it's nice. Not anything crazy. I can see through it pretty good. And then I have this. Dang it. I bet I wonder if I have the same color. I have almost the exact same color, if not the same color. I got this from last year. Mm, it might be a different color. It's this one right here. It might be a different color. I can't quite tell. I'll put it on, see if it's the different. Mm, it looks very, very similar. I'm just okay. My first one, but kind of bummed about that, that I have the same lipstick, but it is really great lipstick. I've loved it. I got it like two years ago and I don't, I think I still have it. Is that everything? That's everything. And then a ton of this. 
Yay. Okay, so I am very impressed with all this. It's good product. Um, nothing's like too crappy, which is, I mean, I figured it would be really good coming from Sephora, which is part of the reason why I switched over. So I'm glad that I did. Sorry the light's getting, it's getting dark. But I'm trying to do it really fast. Okay. Ta-da! Yay! Okay, so now, let's go through, let's see what, some of this is not mine. Some of it's Jason. It's only like one or two things. Okay, so I got some white pants. I hope that they fit. I hope, I hope. I don't want to get any makeup on them. They're just some Rockstar jeans from Old Navy. I hope that they fit. Because I've been having trouble with jeans. But anyways, so these are my brand new white pants for spring. I am so excited. And then here's a couple other things. I have a lot of it's dirty. I've been wearing it. But then I got this cute shirt at Old Navy. It's a little high-low. I really like it a lot. And here's if you can see cute pattern. So I'm excited to wear that in the spring. And then, this is not everything, but it's okay. So this one is LuLaRoe, and um, I have a friend that has a LuLaRoe shop, and I'll link her down. She has a Facebook shop, but um, she does the cute Periscope things, and oh, it's so cute. So I got this dress. It's called a Julia dress. Um, she has tons of cool... Um, Tons of cool patterns and different things. She has a couple that are um, are like plain, but the cool thing is, and the interesting thing is, she can't just say people can't just go up and say, "I want a gray Julia dress." She's like, "Great, I don't have one." She gets she pays for a huge um, shipment, and she just gets what she gets, which is always kind of interesting because people are trying new things. They get she gets leggings with like unicorns on them, and pigs that are flying, and tons of bizarre things. But it's so cool and people love it. So I really love this dress. I'm super excited to wear it. I just got it in the mail a couple days ago. It's supposed to be like a tight-fitting dress. I think I got it too big. So I would definitely say go smaller than you think. This is a small, and I actually think an extra small would fit fine. So bummer about that. That's okay. And then this one I got, and I posted on about this a little while ago. I love this dress. Look at those prints. I got this, I think, off of Jane.com. And it is so gorgeous. I'm so excited to wear this more often in the spring. Um, let me go see if I can find my other clothes. It feels like I've shop been shopping a lot, but I've spent, like, nothing because I am a good shopper. Okay, so then I got these cute pants. These are from Old Navy, too. But I love this. It has this, like, little thing down the front. I can't even think of the name of it. And it's, they're capris, and they're super cute. Sorry, I'm sitting on the ground because my room is kind of messy. So, and they are stretchy in the back. So I'm actually excited about this because I got them kind of small. But when I begin to get fat being pregnant, which is not now, I'm not pregnant, but eventually, um, they can kind of grow with me a little bit at first. So I don't have to go immediately to... Um, maternity pants because I hate that so I'm always looking because I'm still having kids so I'm always looking at things I can um, wear like long term I feel like I'm having so many different sizes in my closet and it's kind of bothering me because if I lose weight then I don't have anything to wear and I have to buy a bunch of new stuff which is kind of the reason why I'm buying so much okay oh it might be dirty I hope it's not dirty maybe you can't see from far away so it's cute shirt it's mostly for fall I think in winter but I've loved wearing it lately I love the gray. It's such a pretty gray. It's not too dark. I mean, it's dark, but it's heather gray, so it kind of can go a little bit more into the warmer months without looking too out of place. I feel like super dark colors don't do super well in the spring and summer. I'm just not drawn to them. And then I got this top. It's another high-low. I am inter I mean, I've worn this like a time or two. And I think it's kind of weird that it's squared on this side in the back and rounded in the front. But it's still so cute. I wore these with this with some camo leggings the other day, and it was adorable. I just loved it. Um, and then I got a couple of these, like, plain shirts from, um, from Old Navy. Everything's always from Old Navy. That's always where I'm at. But that's okay. Um, I need to venture out a little. I got these cute little shirts. 
they're not anything crazy. They're still high low. That's a huge thing right now. Um, they're so soft, like baby soft. And um, I like the sleeves. They have a little bit of a dropped sleeve, which I like. And I got this color, and then I got a white one too. And the white one I got stuff on it the very first day. Of course I have children, whatever. Okay, then last but not least is I went to Sam Moon last yesterday while the children were napping and Jason was home because it was a holiday. Um, and, well, it's all funky. And I got this necklace and I love it. So this is this cute little guy. They had them and they're only $2.99 for the necklace and these little earrings. I mean, they weren't cute earrings, but they are little earrings that came with it. Not anything crazy. I mean, they're teeny tiny. So I got those, and then I got these on sale. They're so cute. And I can kind of wear those year-round. And then I got these guys. So cute. I'm so excited. And then I got these I've been eyeing these on like Jane and group deals and they're always sold out by the time I get to them I'm so annoyed then I got these guys and then I just got a gold chain but that's just for something else anyways so yeah that's kind of what I've been doing lately I don't I really don't spend very much money on all of these things this whole bag this everything was like 15 bucks for like six or seven things. I don't feel like that's bad at all. And then, um, whoa, my yes, please, back. And then all the clothes that I bought were like 30 bucks maybe with all of the um, points and stuff that I had, as well as I got a pair of black pants that are really, really cute. They're high-waisted, and they have the same thing, like these red ones with a little thing down the front, and they actually come with a cute little V right here, but I think they're dirty. They're in the laundry. But anyways, I'm so excited for all my new stuff. And I got Jason some cute shoes. Let's see what they, I don't know if he's gonna like these. But we shall see. They kind of look green. Oh, uh, crap. Okay. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I hope that you love my Sephora box and I will post all the different things down below and in my blog and kind of give you a little bit more information on all the products. Um, I filmed a review today of all of the Walmart and Target boxes and all that kind of stuff that I had been through so far and um, I probably will still post that but I might do everything all at once and just talk about all of my favorites. So we shall see. I At the end of the month I'm going to do a February favorites of all the things from my boxes that I've loved um, and certain things that I didn't like. So. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a great evening. Bye.